absolutely huge update for Boostroid. Now you can record your gameplay session up to 30 seconds of a short video of your gameplay during a Boostroid gaming session. This is fantastic news. This is so great. I've always wanted this and loads of new updates, changes besides that. But the ability to record videos, man, I've been wanting this for so long. Now GFN, GFN has, some, has the ability to record yourself, uh, your gameplay, but having on Boostroid and having that alongside the ability to stream the game is amazing, fantastic, fantastic, this is so great. Uh, and let's read out the rest of the updates. Fixed an issue, that minor issue that could occur when switching from a session from another client. This is version 1.8.0 by the way, released on 15th of February. Continuing, fixed added an attempt to reinitialize the video decoder in case of a certain error. Fixed minor UI improvements. New added the ability to record short videos 30 seconds during gaming session. New requesting user permission to send crash dumps. Linux, pretty much the same stuff. Let's check Mac OS. Fixed a minor issue that could occur when switching a session from another client. Fixed minor UI improvements. New added the ability to record short videos 30 seconds during a gaming session. New requesting user permission to send crash dumps. So this is all the same. Uh, what is the one that this has? Okay, Windows has this this bit exclusive to Windows, uh, but that's the only difference between each of them. Uh, two new games. Oh, this is huge! Grand Blue Fantasy Relink, Hell Divers Two in the install section. This is fantastic news. Absolutely great. Hell Divers Two is probably one of the most popular games on Steam right now. In the top of the top selling Steam charts, Grand Blue Fantasy. Lots of people are very hyped about this game as well. This is so fantastic, and I'll definitely be updating my Boostroid client, which is very easy. As soon as I, as soon as I click on Boostroid, you will be able to see. I load up the application. It's going to prompt me to update the application. So you see, I was on version 1.7.6. I click on update, and it's going to, it's going to update that. Click on yes and here we are it's loading and this is fantastic news I'm really really happy about this and yeah you will have to log into your account obviously and then you will have two new games waiting for you and the ability to record short videos uh, okay I will give that a try very shortly